Welcome to Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis. Light, it's a light racket conversation day. You have to stay tuned. All right, so my buddy Christian here uh, emailed me and subject line was light racket conversation, question mark. So he says, hi, thanks for all the good tennis content you put online. I've been following you for the last two years and learned a lot because of you and Tennis Spin. Well, thank you, Christian. I appreciate that. Um, I started tennis a few years ago and finally bought three different rackets, all head models, all in the light versions, two extreme graphite XTs, one UTEC speed. Now that I'm getting better, I'm playing with heavier rackets and it's Clash and Prince Tour 95. My question is, is there any way to mod my light rackets with silicone, lead, etc.? etc. into a more normal version without screwing up the balance and the character of the sticks. Many thanks for your time. Great question, Christian. Yes, those rackets can be modified, salvaged to kind of fit your needs. And I'm going to tell you exactly how to do that right now. Um, so all we really need is just plain old lead, plain old lead, if that's available. If not, then titanium uh, or whatever will work also. But I mean, lead is probably the cheapest and the easiest to work with. So what I have is three rackets here. I got a Gravity S Ultra 100 Lite. and a Blade 100 Lite, the new version. So let me start by doing this. My guess is that your new rackets, your Prince um, 95 Tour, let's say, will have a, this number right here, four points head light, will have a different balance point than this one because as the rackets get lighter, as I was showing you in a different video, as the rackets get lighter, the the balance of it gets head heavier. So when you got your new rackets and when you got your new heavier rackets, they're basically more handle heavy versus head heavy. So your first job is to take this grip off, take everything off here, everything. And try it like this first. Try it like this first. Take the strips of lead. Take the strips of lead. And put full strips down the four bevels. All the way down from here to here. I've shown you this on a couple other videos. And I will um, attach those videos to below. Okay. So four main strips. Throw the grip back on or use a new grip. So he here's another key though. If you only change the overgrips, then yes, throw that replacement grip right back on, throw an overgrip on, and you should be good to go. Test out the weight, and actually, it should be ready to go just by four strips straight down. For those of you who don't want to take this off, I've seen people do this, uh, even pros, they take it and they place it over the existing replacement grip. So four strips, four half inch strips, just down the main four bevels here. So like a square, okay? And then put an overgrip over that and then see how you like it. Adjust it as you need it. You possibly need a little bit more but definitely not less. Now, if you're very used to, if you're very used to what the four points headlight of this racket, 
what you're going to want to do is put two strips down on the main bevels and then rebalance it at the top. So if you're going to put two, this is probably about six to eight inches, more like eight inches um, down here. You're going to probably want to put about eight inches right here at 10 and two, like through here and through here. Yeah, that's only if you like the four points headlight. So that'll basically keep it where it is in terms of balance. So if you really wanted to be um, fancy with it, you get that putty stuff and you put it in inside here, the weighted putty. Or in some in one of my other videos, you just kind of fold this up and put like a what do you call that? Um, cotton, ball. cotton ball. So you put a cotton ball in there to hold it in so it doesn't rattle and then pop the thing back on. And then you take that weight, you measure that weight, and then you counter it right at the top here. So you would have, actually have to still add lead. So therefore, you would weight the bottom and weight the top, the two farthest ends of the racket. And it will maintain the same balance. But like I said, in these light rackets, they probably just need more weight in the handle. So Christian, for your heads, I would say start with, like I said, the handles first, play with it. And if you can't get used to the, you know, the balance alteration, then add the same amount to the 10 and two o'clock area. And that will make it feel more like home, but a little bit heavier. All right. So I'm going to link some of the videos below as to how I do it. And hopefully that helps you out. All right. Christian, thank you for the question. Keep them coming. I'll, uh, I'll keep doing uh, the videos from your questions as uh, I see fit and how they apply to everybody else out there. All right. Thank you for watching Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis.